Last week I built this homemade power station, and I'm going to be doing a capacity test on it soon, but first I had to charge it up, so I bought these solar panels. And that's, this is actually what I want to talk about today. These are two 100 watt bifacial panels, and I'd never had bifacial panels before, and I didn't buy them um, on purpose. I bought them just because they were inexpensive, and I... I just needed two small solar panels to charge this guy that would be semi-portable. And uh, I found these, and I thought, well, you know, I've always wanted to try bifacial, so let's give it a shot. And also, they were cheap. They were like 65 bucks each off of Amazon. So uh, I got them, and um, they've been doing really well. And the one thing about bifacial is, uh, obviously, is that the sun actually comes on the other side, too. So if you put something reflective on the other side, you will greatly improve the output of these guys also I've seen people actually mount these vertically instead of facing south so you can actually mount these east west vertically and capture energy in the mornings and in the afternoons and then have a different set that are traditional that capture energy in the middle of the day so I've been really happy with these guys been impressed uh, I'll put the brand name um, under here because I can't remember what they are, but the, you know they were cheap, uh, they work nice. Um, they're in series, so as with anything that's in series, if you put if you block something and you can see right now it's still early morning and I have something a shadow on it, so they need complete sun. So if you block them, you uh, greatly reduce the uh, the output. And again, you got to add something reflective on the back side, and you can just get that extra pop. Of, um, of production. These are about 80-85% of the rated capacity, so uh, a rated output. So again, I've been really happy with them. Just a quick video while I'm waiting for them to charge, and then in a couple days I'm going to do a capacity test on my new solar homemade solar power station. And that's it for today.